Hello everyone, so I'm inside Dollar Tree and this is the first time that I have seen these as part of the summer line. I've never seen the pineapple, watermelon, I believe lime. So cute. They have these tumblers with the fixed straw and it's glittery. And look, check these out. These are actually color changing cups with the sentiment along the front. I think they're going to sell so quick. Mingos were just put out and they sell very fast. So if you need some, definitely check your local Dollar Tree because the flamingos go, go, go. These are new this year. They're drink markers and they're actually like a flexible rubber. They aren't a hard plastic. They have all these fun cups. Oh, check this out. See how they're like a, a bendy. These are great too. Lots of colors, fun themes for parties. I love these napkins. They've been out for a few years with the gold foiling. I love that this is white, very simple. I can play with it and it will save me from having to cut paper with my Cricut. Cute little banners. These are also new. They're the honeycomb tassels and they have the pink and the blue. I wish they had some white ones too, actually. These are new as well. They're the poppers and they have the pink and the blue. If anyone is looking, I'm not sure if they work well. Oh, these I haven't seen in forever. I might have to spray paint them, but they're super cute. I really love when Dollar Tree has nice gift bags with not like those really bright colors. It almost makes the bag look less expensive. But when they do these lighter colors, I feel like it just makes the bag look a little higher end. It looks like a Hallmark bag. Look how pretty that one is. So anyways, that's just my opinion. But the less vibrant for me, the better. But I'm neutral all the time, right? Boring. And these are super easy to manipulate and customize to fit a theme. I am hosting a baby shower this summer for my sister-in-law. So, of course, I'm a little bit more inclined towards this area of the store. These came out about a month or so ago, a couple months maybe now. And they're really great. If you're a couponer or you like to organize receipts, these are accordion style envelopes and they, are, they hold nicely. They also have these for those who love sticky notes and lists and note taking or list making, I should say, because they're small pages. But These are new and they usually come out every spring with a new line but there's a whole bunch of them this year and they each come with a sticker pa uh, page on the front and then they're lined pages. So again, just a nice little notebook if you wanna put it in your purse, they fit nicely. You have so many, great for journaling, writing goal lists, all those kinds of things. This magnetic clip it looks really nice and hefty or um, sturdy. Something maybe to put on the side of my filing cabinet for work. These ones here, scratch. The beaded wreaths are selling very, very quickly. Along These ones kind of stick around, but they do go as well. But if you see the wreath and you want it, definitely buy it. Has anyone been able to use this as an actual paint stand so if you're painting on one of the canvas canvases here from Dollar Tree if you're able to use that I don't think you would it's more just a display stand right some stickers we'll go over to the sticker aisle after by the way these are I guess like a ceramic. They're really cute. Oh, 
Oh, I think that is over. Anyways, there's a circle and a butterfly, it looks like. And I've seen, oh, a star too. I've seen some other things. These are bamboo rings. They have some pretty new stickers, it looks like, for maybe the summer or spring collection. Sunflowers or white daisies, I should say, with the little ladybugs are new. I feel like these have been around. These are kind of been around or it's hard to remember sometimes and I just go back on my sticker collection. I'm like, oh no, no, those are, they've been here for a while. Oh, these are new. Burlap flowers. These are good for the fall wreaths. I always like looking at their Crayola stuff because sometimes they have some really nice Crayola things. Check these out, they're new, and you can flip the sentiment. How stinking cute is that? They still have a selection of metal and they seem to keep putting out more cutouts. I'm not sure if anyone's been using these in their DIYs, but if you have, maybe let us know what you've created with them. It's a nice, maybe like a beach sign or something that you can use the relax on. Oh, I like these. They give me the Where's Waldo vibe. This is the first time I'm seeing koala. The koala, these are usually a little more pricey at the grocery store. I feel like they might even be close to $5, which is crazy. But Oh, I've tried these and the cookies and cream. And oh my goodness, they were so, so good. Uh, if you like Pocky, I think it's called, you'll like these a lot. animal crackers I've heard you can dip these arrowroot vanilla in like icing and it's kind of got like that original Dunkaroos flavor I'm gonna grab one of these hmm I was actually looking up ginger turmeric turmeric tea for I guess like helping with digestion in your tummy these are new and you can easily paint them if you don't like the colors to suit your home decor. So don't ever look at something from Dollar Tree and say, oh, I don't like the colors because you can just paint it with some acrylic paint. These are cute for the farmhouse stylers. If you do tear trays or little staging. What else do they have here? Oh, some, oh, I like this. Even for my craft room. They've got rings with butterflies. It's almost like a plasticky paper. I don't know how to explain it. Lots of butterfly cutouts here. These are foiled. So I'm thinking of making little table numbers and I'm, I think I like the gold. I'm doing an English theme garden tea, a baby shower theme for my sister-in-law and I'm looking here and I'm like I don't know oh this one's not clear so I wouldn't like that I don't know um where I should do for the little table numbers this would be cute even for setting up her baby picture or a loved one's picture on the side so many nice options here look at this just attach the number so anyways I have some choosing to do here <laughs> I was surprised to spot these at a different Dollar Tree and here they are. So I thought I better share with you. It comes with two covers and a mouse and then there's also the webcam. I don't know if people are still using them. Tell me these aren't the cutest vases. And here is some brand name stuff. This is made by the Orby company. There's some new fidget type bracelets. Up and I'm so excited because they almost give me a watercolor vibe and I just love the little bees on here you can do so many nice effects with these types of stamps here's some more of the orb sensory and oh my goodness I am contemplating on purchasing a few of these to make table napkins because I love to have napkins 
out all the time and for the price and the colors the selection has anyone made any oh i love this anyways i am so excited sometimes when i spot things at dollar tree i get super pumped and i'm like oh i need to do this or i need to do that does anyone else go through that look at all these pretty colors too you can make gift bags with them oh, this one has the garden gnomes you can use them for paper crafting journaling sewing in your paper crafts there's just so many things you can do with these fabric squares if you have other ideas that you've used them for let us know because it's not it's not common to find them for the price i'm not sure exactly what this spells maybe eat most exciting finds today are these so they feel like the ikea plastic they're a super beautiful thick plastic perfect for one of those rolling carts I had to share with the share this with you because it's a nice size and you can do something on the back and check out the little gnomes for a tear tray i love the little minions each of them so cute i spotted some more of these and they were on a bottom shelf and i had to share them there are three colors some more gnomes they're heavy so that you can even use them as a door stopper I love the lemon print. Look what's back on the shelf. I hope you enjoyed walking around Dollar Tree with me today. I'll leave you with a few little DIYs using Dollar Tree items that I've transformed. The gnome is very popular this time of year along with the birds. So if you want to make them look like a cement or a plaster, just don't put them outside or they will fall apart. But they're great for tear trays or for just putting on display in your home. I hope you'll follow along to keep up to date on local finds at your local stores. And I just want to say thank you so much for watching. Bye for now. Never leave your side You're the reason to my pride